Hello, I'm Carl, and I'm show you go how to connect a PC controller with an Android device, and and use the controller to play Android games. What you're going to need is an an Android device to compatible with OTG. The OT the on the go. Okay, give this compatible controller and it's Android two point one or two point two and and above. And of course, you're going to need to do right US. Right, USB utility. I'll be using a mini USB to US, male mini USB to US, USB cable, as well as a, an OTG cable. This is, I'm, I'm using, I'll be using Samsung Galaxy S3. I'll just place it there. These are, this is the USB utility, mini USB to USB cable, OTG cable. You're going to need a PS3 controller. And, okay. First, you plug in the mini USB connector in the PS to bring your USB port in your PS3 controller. Then you plug in the, min the USB and the mini USB to USB cable onto the OTG cable. Then you plug in. Then no, this the OTG cable always has a USB port, and this is the connect. This is a connector for the. There will be a connector for your device. In this case, it's a USB mini a micro USB. Version 2.0 <laughs> 2 Then finally you plug in the OTG cap to your Android device. See? I'll move all just to stand so that you can see the f and then now after you be controls in pair you see four blinking flashing lights and what you need to do is press the PlayStation button and, and the controller will work. No, you can no, you're going to need you with the controller. You can only play game pass for the games. I'll be testing out Grand Theft Auto Vice City. So, then I exited myself out of the game. I'll try this again. And power the device off. Sorry for the inconvenience. I mean, the 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 Samsung guys just suddenly froze. But let's do this again. Wait. Now let's start this again. Apologies. Nice. I mean, the phone suddenly froze, and so I had to reboot it. But holding the power to power it up, and then holding the power button again to power the phone back on. Okay. Now let's start this again. I'm plugging the mini USB cable to the into the PS2 controller, then the then using the mini USB and then then the USB and the mini USB to USB cable to the OTG cable. Then you plug into the OTG cable to your Android device. <laughs> See the four the, the four lights start flashing. And look, you can't control control. The phone yet with the controller. You have to press the PlayStation button. Before you know it, you can control the phone with the controller. However, this only works on game by supported games. I'll be testing out Grand Theft Auto Vice City, but there's more than that. No, the left, the LT and R3 version, but 
controls are reversed from the, the, the controls of, on the PS2 version of Grand Theft Vice City. L3 is to honk, is to start the submission, and R3 is to honk the horn, and like, reversed from the PS2 version of GTA Vice City, where L3 is to use to honk the horn, and R3 to start the submission. All the controls are reversed, but on other, so most other devices, however, the, the, the face button controls, the controls are reversed. Square and cross, and along with triangle and circle. On the PS2, the face button controls are the same as you would say. Cross to accelerate in vehicle, or... Or... To, or run on foot. Square to jump, or otherwise tap. Or, or to try to cross strike to jump, square to to break or go in reverse in a vehicle, or or to jump, or to one press a jump, jump triangle is to get out enter or exit vehicle circles to attack, but in most other devices is reverse triangles to attack circles to enter exit vehicle, squares to to go f f is to go forward or in a vehicle or in Aren't aren't fought run when held or double t or the double tap the button to jump to jump cross how however will be and most other devices will be used to go back go in reverse uh, go in reverse or go in reverse the vehicle or in foot jump and when press. That's that's in decent component limited to the Nexus seven, the Samsung Galaxy S four Samsung Galaxy S5 and the Samsung Galaxy S3 7.0. Zero. All the other controls will also hit. Start to pause or unpause the game. Select to change views. The exit D pad to move. To move on foot or left and right to steer. And up and down to up to accelerate and down to break or reverse. Depth and left, left and right will be used to steer and motorcycle, mot on motorbikes, in in the scooter, the Faggio. The left and right up and down can be used to shift way up. Left is used to shift up, shift way up, and left and left as you see, my left and right, my bad, sorry. Left and right down will be used to to shift way down, and for that is used to move. On the right and left is used to look around. And with, when you press L2, the right analogs, when you see the right, and you see the right analogs, like you, you, you get the, you get. First person, R2 is to change the next weapon, L2 changes the previous weapon. R1 is used to aim, and then that only applies for guns. L1 is to change the view straight. Where time of Versetti, the protagonist, time of Versetti is looking. L1 is to use to change the radio stations. R1 will be used to use the handbrake. R2 is used to look to the right. L2 is used to look to the left. Pressing L, both L2 and R2 will make you look backwards. See, R3 is to honk the horn. L3. A side mission, which we can't do in the Vista Compact. What we can do in, uh, in vehicles such as the police car, the ambulance, and, and the fire truck. We have got control with the police. Well, we're done. We just have to press the to place the button. Uh, holding it will just make the test measure. And this is how you connect the PS2 controller to an Android device. 